first, I'm going to tell you everything I like about these Leland Cypress trees. Now, I'm going to tell you what I don't like. Yes, I don't really like the Leland Cypress trees because the form of the tree when they get larger has a lot of branching and they thin out inside the tree. And then over a period of time, it doesn't look very good. Not only that, Leland cypresses can get windburned, such as these Leland cypresses that got windburned at our farm. These were in pots, and potted Leland cypresses can burn if left to the winter winds, especially in New Jersey, Pennsylvania, and New York. So I don't recommend that you plant Leland cypresses. In fact, even the U.S. government, which I despise because of all their shenanigans that they've been pulling, says in a USDA ag site, don't plant Leland cypresses. And for once in my life, I have to agree with the government and that the government is saying something that's correct. Do not plant Leland cypresses. They are not very hardy. If you need a tree that's like the Leland cypress and grows large and fast like the Leland cypress, you should be considering a tree that's called Thuja plicata green giant. The green giant is an arborvita, but it's also part, partially a cedar tree. So the green giant is an excellent choice for a replacement of Leland cypresses. Don't let your Leland cypresses look like this and plant them and then expect them to look good because you will have problems. On the other hand, if you plant the green giant arborvita, it has nice lush green foliage and from a distance will look like the Leland cypress and it will grow very fast, just like the Leland cypress, but it's sturdier, hardier, and also more disease resistant than Leland cypress. So what can I say good about the Leland cypress? Not very much, but for the green giant arborvita, there's a lot to be said for these arborvitas. These were left out in the cold winter during the, the, the harsh winter we had with zero degrees. And you can see they're not even damaged slightly. The green giant will give you many years of enjoyment. And when you plant them, you plant them five to ten feet apart. I like to plant them six or seven feet apart and have a double staggered row. Then you get real quick fill in and you get a sturdy tree that will last you a long, long time. This is Bill at Highland Hill Farm. This video was produced at Highland Hill Farm. We grow and sell screening and buffering trees in Bucks County, Pennsylvania. And these are our green giant arborvitas. Call us for your screening tree needs at 215-651-8329.